What's up, bitches? First off, before I begin this video, let me just say congratulations to the Philadelphia Eagles on winning the Super Bowl. I could not believe they actually did it in the way they, like, it was a shootout the entire game. The, the final score ended up being, what was it, 41-37, 41-38? Now today we've got ourselves a new series. Every year I like to do this and this year I'm gonna fully commit to this one. It is the Carolina Panthers fantasy franchise. We've got legends, we've got, yo, I'm telling you right now, for some of my longtime fans when I used to stream this like back in Madden 15, I had a player on the team, his name was OJ Simpson. Have you guys heard of him? What are your thoughts on the OJ release? <laughs> Yes, he is probably going to be, if we get the draft right, if we can draft him, he will be making his return to the team because, of, like, who doesn't want OJ Simpson on their team? Either way, let's go over some of the players that are actually in this. And the download roster, I'm going to leave the actual name of it in the description of the video. So if you would like to use it, link will be in the description. There's over like a thousand plus legends. Some are, I think there's like a few repeats considering the fact they were legends on multiple teams and they were great on multiple teams. So guys, I went and backed out of franchise mode and now we're actually on manage rosters in the actual main menu of the game. And now we're going to take a quick look at all the legends that are on or that are actually in this roster that we downloaded and as you can see i'm already seeing some names that aren't even in madden slash ultimate team right now we got jim brown uh walter payton who's surprisingly not in the game this year jack ham again another linebacker i'd love to see this year we got randy moss on the vikings william perry deacon jones joe montana and bro that's brian hoyer so it does look like this guy actually took some current nfl players and just changed their names like brian hoyer is apparently joe montana which is hilarious now those stats right there the college the weight and height are all correct for joe montana i'll shut up and he got every detail there and guys that's just a small glimpse at, at who's actually on the roster now with that being said ladies and gentlemen it is now time to draft the teams i will be back in just a moment a few moments later and guys we have finally drafted the team and i've gotta say there were some players i wanted to pick up that i could not get i wanted to draft them but at the same time when life gives you lemons you make lemonade when life closes one window you open up another one. And ladies and gentlemen, I introduce to you the new and improved My Carolina Panthers. We changed up some schemes we are running now the normally the carolina panthers would run a 4-3 defense we went and just read no 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 we got rid of that we are now running an attacking 3-4 defense our offense west coast offense the way i like to run it we got ourselves michael vick chris johnson legarrett blunt stephen davis hold up i had to hit somebody Brennan Marshall, Harold Carmichael, Moose Muhammad, Chris Collinsworth, Brian Finneran, and Juju Smith-Schuster are our wide receivers and our offensive line. Mwah, you can't defeat it. Jonathan Ogden, Gene Upshaw, Mike Webster, Bruce Matthews, Dan Dienorf. We got Vernon Davis. This offense... You, you know, we're not we're not being stopped and defensively like I said we are running a 3-4 defense and that means I had to pick up uh, remember when I said I couldn't get a few people we had to make do on the defense we have at middle linebacker John Beeson and Ryan Chazier those are two. John Beeson's a Carolina legend no doubt former New York Giant former Carolina Panther a one of the be he was a, an amazing middle linebacker. Sadly, injuries pretty much derailed his career, which sucks. We have at free safety. I'm moving D'Angelo Hall, and I'm, excuse me, I'm putting D'Angelo Hall in for Reggie Nelson. We've got Ken Houston. Shout out to my man, Show Out. Huge Titans fan. I had to pick up Ken Houston on the corners. We got Darrell Rivas, Asante Samuel, Jonathan Joseph, Ricky Manning, and Ken Lucas. And our specialist, it's going to be at kicker, Justin Tucker, and at punter, Pat McAfee. Like I said, this whole franchise just about having fun thank you guys so much for watching i cannot wait for episode two take it easy y'all have a safe one
Jeez. Welcome back everyone to Sports Center Carolina Radio. My name is the Carolina Guru. Now today we have to talk about Carolina Panthers training camp is underway and we're going to be seeing a lot out of the offense on this one. We're more or less going to be looking at today Michael Vick, Chris Johnson, Mr. CJ 2K. We're also going to be taking a look at the offensive line, see how they hold up against the defense. That's the one thing that's going to be important this year is the offensive line. If the Panthers expect Chris Johnson to do anything this year, they're going going to need that offensive line to make the holes for him. We're also going to be looking at today Michael Vick and how he connects with the wide receivers. We do have a Carolina legend coming back in Musa Muhammad but that's not all. We also have Harold Carmichael, Brennan Marshall. We get to look at those guys and again the biggest thing is for the defensive side anyway, how do the cornerbacks match up? I want to see how this defense plays. It's just all in all we're getting a sneak peek at how this team will look and fare in the preseason. I'm your host the Carolina Guru and I'll see you guys for the recap of the preseason. I'll be honest with you. Mentally, I'm fucked up. I ain't never looked up. The game never loved us. I work hard for everything I got and still somehow I give fuck. Muse love, love, and trust. I think it's ridiculous, my nigga. I found my best friend in the swisher.